Good morning and welcome back. Guess who's back? Back again. Apple's back. He's our friend. Good Where morning. Fly away. How are you? How are you? I'm good. How are you? Get myself organized. There you here. go. There you Thank go. Thank you. Uh, welcome back. How are you? How was Thank your time you. off? It was great. Good. Really, really, really good. Relaxing. Went on, a, went, went on a road trip, Melanie. Road trip. Those are fun. Yep. Yeah. Went to the States for the first time in years, it seems like. Was, went and visited some friends. Good. Uh, also, uh, interestingly enough, they, uh, these folks uh, celebrate their wedding anniversary on the same day that my wife and I do. So yes, happy anniversary. 20 years, 20, 20, thank you. 20 years back, we were not able to uh, see each other on our respective wedding days. So because we you were said, busy. Hey, let's get, let's, we were kind of busy. <laughs> kind so of busy, okay. Uh, let's get together. And, and so anyway, we went uh, into the U.S. and a uh, yeah, nice uh, road trip and um, didn't have any interest in flying anywhere. So saw Tammy's piece on... Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll we'll, we'll, we'll break that. Forget that. Not, we'll break that down. Not, you're PGing uh, that. I see. I see. Okay. Well, let's break down what you are doing today. Uh, and the word yes. of the last, I don't know, a couple of years has been inflation. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, it certainly has been for the past year uh, because, uh, you know, it's just been going up and up. And this morning we've got uh, another record-breaking inflation rate, this one out of the European Union, which is at 8.1%. And it's all about fuel. It's all about food. The Eurozone is directly, immediately affected by the war in Ukraine, which is having a global uh, effect from an inflationary standpoint. And the European Union just today has approved this partial and expanding ban on Russian oil imports or exports, depending on which way it's, it's going. So that's just going to make it even more expensive for fuel prices going forward. Watching the price for oil this morning surge to north of $119 per barrel U.S. Wholesale gas is at a record. That's what we look at for the price of the pumps here in the GTA. Expect a, a spike later this week. There's no way of getting around this. We're at four dollars. What are we at? Um, I can't what are keep we track. at per liter here. Two dollars, two dollars and, and four cents a liter. It was four sixty nine, four seventy nine thereabouts. What I was seeing uh, driving uh, through Vermont and New Hampshire, and then down to Massachusetts, and then back across uh, New York State. They're paying over six dollars a gallon in California. I will say this is completely anecdotal, Melanie. I'm driving as far as I did. There was virtually no one on the roads. I-90 was empty, hmm. and that was on Memorial Day weekend. Yeah, that's strange. That was really surprising. I, I kept saying to my wife, where is everybody? Oh, yeah, it costs a lot to fill up. So I'm wondering if we're starting to see that. We keep talking about people putting road trips on hold because mm -hmm. it's too expensive, and Changing it's having a ripple behaviors. effect. Yeah. Changing behavior, exactly. And I'm, and I'm curious if that is something that is uh, is uh, going to be correlated here over the next uh, several weeks. Yeah, we shall see. Uh, TSX, mm -hmm. the win streak continues. Yep, a seven-day win streak. Uh, energy stocks. <laughs> Kel Surprise <laughs> uh, have been going up. Suncor is at a four-year high. Bank stocks have also been strong. Uh, they had really strong earnings last week. They're raising the dividends. Those have been going up. Today's the last day of May. I heard you talking about reminding me of that with Frankie off the top this morning. How are we at the end of May already? What happened? Anyway, it's been actually a pretty good month here for, for the Bay Street to market today. Might be a different story watching stock futures drop just a little bit because they're back from the three-day weekend in the U.S. Mike, before we let you go, are you a fan mm -hmm. of the hot weather? Sure. You like Absolutely. it? Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. Look, All right. If, if it's below 10 Celsius, I'm typically cold. It's just okay. the way my, my metabolism works. So anything north of that, I'm good. All Thank right. You. All right. Well, Mike will appreciate the day. Have a good one. Enjoy the heat.